Hello everyone. So I wanted to go live tonight and bust one of the biggest marriage myths I have ever heard in my whole life. But for some reason, so many people cling to this false idea. Now let me tell you how I came up with this idea. So I went running tonight with my hubby because that's what we love to do together. But actually we, we go running together but he always runs like in front of me right and so i always i'm like tricked into not taking my phone and my headphones because i'm like i'm running with my hubby it's gonna be great we're gonna talk the whole time but actually what happens is he runs about half a football field he's running like half a football field in front of me right and so there i am running pushing myself trying to catch up to him with nothing to listen to in my ears but my own thoughts and i've been thinking about this so much lately because i have been getting so many emails and dms from people who are looking for marriage advice and help and i keep seeing this pattern over and over and over again and i just want to like i don't know what i want to do but i I need people to understand that they are operating under such a false idea. And so as I was running tonight, trying to keep up with my husband, I, I had this thought, I know I can help these people and I answer their emails and I offer to help, but I can help more people if I just start busting these myths. And so I thought, what if I start going live at night, kind of after kids are in bed and people are kind of settled in and I start just busting these marriage myths that are so deeply ingrained into our, like our society, into our head. And I just like help people maybe realize that some of the ways they're thinking are keeping them stuck. So the number one thing that I have been seeing so much of repeatedly over and over and over again in these messages and these emails and these pleas for help are people who want to improve their relationship with their spouse but they want their spouse to change something. I get these emails that are like, I want so badly to have a great marriage, but I just, if only my spouse would blank. And there's so many variations of this. If only my spouse would help with the kids more. If only my spouse would help more around the house. If only my spouse would take some initiative. If only my spouse would this or that then I could probably have like the best marriage ever. And that is so flawed because the only person that we have any control over is ourselves. And the truth is that we can have the most incredible marriage beyond our wildest dreams with connection and love and intimacy and passion and fulfillment and so much pleasure if we will but only take responsibility and change what we have control over. If we will stop trying, this works not only in your marriages, but in your work relationships, in your relationships with your siblings, within your relationship with your parents, in any relationship that you are involved in, if you will take responsibility for yourself and your actions, it is incredible the amount of change in the dynamic that can happen in that relationship. So if you are thinking that I would be so happy at work or I would be so happy in my marriage, if only these people would change blank, that is keeping you stuck. It's keeping you from making any progress. It's keeping you from being happy. It's keeping you from reaching your dreams. I just, want to reach out and put my hands on either side of you on your shoulders and say listen nobody has to change anything for you to be happy and have everything in this life that you desire so that's the number one myth i want to bust about marriage tonight i was just busting the marriage myth that you could have a really great marriage if your spouse changed x and that's a total myth and it's totally false and it's keeping you stuck. I hope that you're staying healthy. I hope that you're connecting with your families. I hope that you're doing the things that make your heart happy during this quarantine.
I just want to help. I want I want to help people experience the joy and the pleasure and the fulfillment, the connection and intimacy that I know you can all have in your marriages. So I'm just going to show up and we're just going to we're just going to bust some marriage myths. We're just going to go through some stuff. So I'll see you guys again tomorrow night right here.